Hello YouTube, Pope Grisco, coming from Decatur, George, as always. Um, hope everyone's doing fine. Uh, my part of Atlanta is still without service, so I'm in the dark. But I did sneak into my fridge and pulled out a Session Black. Um, a couple days ago, uh, web phenom uh, <laughs> Joffrey the Giant, who's a, a YouTube presenter for uh, a lot of pipe content, <laughs> Uh, sorry. Uh, yeah, I posted on his Facebook that he was drinking the lager. said it was somewhat um, unremarkable. Um, but uh, I saw how cheap this was when I went to the beer store. Um, it was about $11 for uh, 12 11 ounce bottles. So I decided I would go ahead and splurge. And uh, worse that would be that I'd have, you know, mediocre beer, which, you know, I drink high life. so. I kind of like mediocre beer sometimes. Um, so, let's go ahead and do a review. It's a nice dark brown, almost black ale. Excuse me, I'm going to get something in the bud real quick. Sorry about that. Um, yeah, it's a nice dark black, I'm sorry, dark brown. Um, the body tend to be more opaque than at the bottom, but just come out uh, a very nice uh, chestnut color in the sunlight. Head is a little off-white, but predominantly white. Uh, malt forward smell, a little maybe a little sourness. It's not bad. Um, definitely malt forward. Uh, bitterness is not from, uh, you know, it's not really a hop bitterness flavor. It's more of a, like a citrus bitterness. It's more of like a, a burnt coffee bitterness, which would be consistent with the type of beer it is, I guess. Um, it's, it's wet, and it has a flavor, um, it's a lot of burnt coffee flavor to it, maybe a little bit of chocolate, but nothing amazing, um, so, uh, I guess much like Joffrey's assessment of the, uh, of the lager, it's unremarkable, but it's cheap, and, yeah, I'll drink the rest of it, probably won't buy any more. Thanks for watching, and um, as always, uh, feel free to check out more of my content at popecrisco.blogspot.com, uh, and you can also uh, sign up for my uh, Twitter feed, The Intoxico. Prost.